What's up guys, Shane Stars with Droid Modder X, and this is just going to be a quick tip on how to enable root on CyanogenMod 12 and also how to enable the custom reboot menu. So if you press and hold the power button, you can actually get a reboot menu that allows you to, to reboot the phone, soft reboot the phone, and boot into recovery and also boot into bootloader mode. That boot into recovery mode is pretty awesome. Uh, because that allows you to quickly get in recovery mode if you need to wipe data or if you need to back up something. You're able to do that very quickly without having to install a third-party application like Flashify or memorize the button combination, which can sometimes be a pain as well. So in order to enable the custom reboot menu, you're going to go into your settings. So you're going to go to About Phone. You're going to click on the Build Number 7 times to unlock the Developer Options. Then you'll just go into Developer Options and you will check the advanced reboot uh, button here and that will enable the custom reboot menu. While you're in this developer options, you'll wanna go ahead and scroll down to root access. And if you want your phone to be rooted, it's already rooted, but root access is disabled by default. You wanna go down here and press apps only, or if you wanna be able to do uh, super user commands through ADB, uh, you'll do apps and ADB. So once you've done that, you can actually control your root permissions through Privacy Guard. So that's built into CyanogenMod 12. You don't actually have to go to the Play Store and download SuperSU. Uh, you could if you wanted to, but Privacy Guard takes care of not only your app permissions, but also your super user permissions. So any root permissions that are needed, that's all taken care of with Privacy Guard. So we'll go ahead and try Root Checker, and I'll show you guys how the Privacy Guard manages root permissions. So we'll just quickly grab root checker off the Play Store. Okay, so we'll go ahead and open up root checker. We'll agree and we'll verify root. And you'll see the privacy guard actually pops up and asks if you would like to give super user access. So we're going to click remember and allow. That gives us root permission and it tells us that our device has root access. So as guys, that about wraps it up on this quick video of how to enable root access on CyanogenMod 12 and also how to enable the custom reboot menu on CyanogenMod 12. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.